So you've played a bit of Hunted the Demon's Forge, and now you're ready to spend all the gold you've collected. It's time to give Crucible a try. Crucible allows players to make their own dungeon crawl by linking arenas and customizing the enemies and player skills any way they want. It's all about gladiator-style combat, you and a partner against everything that comes at you. Crucible can be played with a buddy AI by a single player, or you can grab a friend and play either online or split screen. Now let me up. There are plenty of options in Crucible, but let's start off with the basics. Want to play with that level 4 weapon set? Or maybe you want to fight that Minotaur in Chapter 3. Make sure you explore everywhere in the main campaign, because the more gold you collect, the more robust dungeon crawl you can make. First off, see how much gold you've collected. Gold discovered in the campaign gives you access to different tiers of options in Crucible. If you want to dive right into Crucible without spending too much time in customization, there's a randomize button that makes it easy to jump into a match. Simply select if you want a quick, medium, or lengthy dungeon crawl and you're ready to go. Quick maps are a great way to get a feel for how Crucible works. And once you're ready to make some tweaks to your map, Crucible allows players to modify their experience in a number of ways. Maybe you want your dungeon crawl to be a little longer. You can add arenas to extend the experience in any direction. You can select the look of each arena or quickly randomize its appearance. Then using the editor, you can modify the action in each arena by adjusting which enemies you'll face. Each arena has 9 spawns of enemies, but each spawn can have up to 100 waves, allowing you to make the Crucible devastatingly difficult. Each arena in a map can also be modified by bestowing endowments or punishments to the player. Want to add a little excitement to the action? Try giving your arena a time limit that can only be extended by killing enemies, or limit the weapons players can use and make the experience more challenging. If you're playing with a newbie who needs a little extra help, try modifying the experience with unlimited arrows or mana restore to give players an extra boost. You can even fiddle with gravity, remove the HUD, or adjust damage modifiers. Lastly, don't forget to check out what you've unlocked often. Gaining gold through the campaign will unlock weapon and spell sets located in the editor that you can access at any time in Crucible. Once you're done customizing your maps, they can be saved and accessed at any time to be played in single player mode or with a friend. If you're really proud of your creation, you can post it online for others to play. When you finish your dungeon crawl, check out your stats. Who's better at headshots? What about executions? You determine it all in Crucible, part of Hunted the Demon's Forge.